Welcome back, Random TV Reviews, your girl and I. And it's your boy, Stan Lab. All right, if y'all are new to the channel, welcome. If you're an old family member, welcome back. Y'all know how it is. And y'all have been on me in my inbox talking all kinds of skit, talking about some, okay, have and have nots is over. What y'all gonna do? What show y'all gonna pick up because we need to see y'all? Well, we picking up a good one for y'all. I don't know about y'all, but I'm sick of Ratchet TV. I'm done mm -hmm. with it. I'm sick of hearing about it. I don't want to hear anybody's <laughs> recaps about it. I'm sick of people just acting a goddamn fool. I'm sick of people fighting. So I said, you know what? But y'all always tell us that we are our couple's goals, which I told y'all stop saying that nobody should be your couple's goals. You should be looking for inspiration from different people, but don't yeah. make nobody your goal because you don't know what the hell they're going through. Exactly. Um, and what they done been through to, yeah. to have what they have. So, we just gonna talk about a show about black love, basically. And yeah. it's um, Tiana and I'm mine, which I have been following them, not closely, because I don't follow any celebrity closely. Um, but I've been following them ever since they had baby Junie. And y'all all know it was all over the blogs. It was all over our um, shade room when he had to deliver the baby. Because Tiana went into labor, I think it was a month early. And he delivered that baby himself on that bathroom floor. Right, so now. after that, I was like, you know what? I got a liking to these people. You know what I'm saying? You know, other than their celebrity, you know, because we can fall in love with people's gifts and their talents and whatnot. But yeah. when you see them in action. The real when, them. Yeah, that's when the you real start them. to be like. Yeah. Okay. Now, this ain't a recap, nothing like that. We just having a discussion. Yeah, we just talk. So that's when I started, kind of. We like, just said the church meeting. Yeah. <laughs> we just kind of peeping them out, seeing what they all about and all of that. And then they got engaged. And then eventually they got married in front of the bathroom where baby Junie was born at. If that's not a testament to how much that baby means to the both of them. Uh -huh. And how her very presence and her existence has changed their lives. I don't know what else will. Yeah, because I, I, you know, I don't know not a woman that will have their wedding right there because y'all in y'all mind it's, it's the church and you got on your big white dress oh, and god or something and, and you got your train coming from the back that's that's reach out to the street <laughs> and you walk down the aisle and you want everybody to see you coming it's all about you it is and for her to do that yeah that's a, that's a whole nother level that's a whole right nother level right there my yeah so um other than them showing you their celebrity, they're showing you how it is that they navigate around life. Just being normal, Amon and Tiana. Just how yeah. they operate as a family and as a unit. And one thing that I did admire right off the bat, they don't have a whole lot of yes men around them. They mm -hmm. don't have a whole lot of groupies and a whole lot of fanfare around them. They have their family around them. Mm -hmm. Somebody that's going to check you when you're wrong. Yep. Tell you the truth. And I mean, and it's balanced. It's not like a whole bunch of her family around and a whole bunch of his family. It's very blended. Her mother is her manager. Iman's dad is like the chef. And he looked like a cook too. Now don't he? He looked like a black chef Brody. You know what he looked like? That uncle that be at that cookout and he always pulling something out the cooler, but you never know what it is. Yeah. But it makes his way on the grill. And he got the, the freaking um, the apron on to say big man. Yeah. And he <laughs> got them Jesus sandals on. Yeah. And when they put the stuff out on the, for the cookout for you to eat, yeah. they be like, taste that. We're like, what's that? Don't worry about it. Just taste yeah. it. Yeah. And then when you say you like it, man, you know you just ate alligator, yo. <laughs> that's all right, though. You ate it already. That, that's what his daddy remind me of. So we have Tiana doing a whole lot of stuff. You know, let me tell y'all what Tiana did for us women. It didn't last long. But it, it was cool. When she came out with that Kanye video, when she was up in that day on video, mm -hmm. showing that body, all of us was like, you know what? We need to get in the gym. I'm going back to the gym tomorrow. Get, get, <laughs> get that stomach get right. Get my skin right. Get these arms right. You know, butt, it, butt sitting up just right. So she changed the world. For like two weeks. Yeah. For like two weeks. But usually week. how long it lasts, a week or two, when it's when <laughs> stuff happened like that. Yeah, and you go, yeah. you go, you change your whole life. For just because you got yeah okay yeah so other than them trying to navigate through life listen i was impressed by the fact that they go to the grocery store i was like y'all go to the grocery store i so i don't know if that was in atlanta or that was in la where they went to the grocery store but yeah. i was like y'all going See, everybody know in my inbox and let me know do how often y'all go and is did y'all like said once a week 
Well, she did say once she a week. She said, she said once a week. Like, and it's I'm a big deal? And I'm surprised I ain't hear nobody screaming. That's what I said. Yeah, nobody screaming. It's like they were walking around like they were us walking through the grocery store. Hell, we be out in public and we get it sometime and we just yeah. shoot two. Yeah, so I don't, yeah, I don't. So how y'all do that? I don't know. I don't know. I, maybe the grocery store was cleared out and we didn't see. I don't know. Yeah. But, um, at some point you don't know who in the relationship with, um, Iman. Is it Tiana or Baby Junie? Because Baby Junie, listen. That's her daddy. Yep. And she gonna let you know that that's her daddy. She ain't taking no skit off of none of y'all when it comes to her daddy. And mm -hmm. her daddy ain't taking no skit off none of y'all when it comes to his daughter. You can tell that's a, that is daddy's daughter right there. Tiana yep. just had her. Now she act like the both of them. Now this one thing I can say about the both of them. They love the hell out of each other. Yeah, they do. But they both spoil rotten. And you mm -hmm. want to know why I can confidently say something like that? We spoil the hell out of each other. Mm -hmm. And then, when we don't get stuff our way, oh, it's World oh, War II. pissed off. Like, when they were in, um... They in the had, car. <laughs> Nick was in he the was, car. She was pissed off because he was on the goddamn phone. It was deeper than that, though. Yeah. Because I got some little background about it. And I might be reading into it too much. But I know how women operate. See, the first you thing he to? said... Ah, uh, yeah, better. <laughs> the first thing he said was, Hey, you see these new shoes that Kanye put out? And she kind of looked like, see, do y'all realize that Kanye is supposed to be pushing and releasing her next album? And he's been dragging his feet ever since she was in that video of his when she blew up like that. So basically, she's on Kanye's timing for her album to come out. So hmm. what you ain't going to do is show me a pair of sneakers as ugly as hell at this very moment. See, <laughs> this me talking like I'm Tiana. This Tiana. So you think he was trying to lighten the mood? No, he was really, he was really looking at the shoes. See, guys don't think like that. But in her mind, them more buckle got time to create put some shoes. Got no shoe. But you can't but put my album, my album. album. Yeah. Where's my skit so yeah. I can make my bread? But that's how we do it. So I can stack my coin. So it's almost like if you owe me five dollars and you walk in the room with a new pair of shoes on, I'm like, I'm oh, automatically. So you this. got the money to pay for them got these shoes. But well, where my five? Where my five dollars? Yeah, yeah, I got you. I got you. I'm with you. Yeah. So, um, probably the last point I'm going to talk about, because I'm telling y'all, y'all need to watch this show. Because I, I have a feeling that it's going to be really good, and you're going to be able to pick up on some nuggets. And you're going to be able to relate to a lot of stuff. Yeah, we may yeah. not have as much going on as they do, because Tiana's in the fitness. She's mm -hmm. acting. She's singing. singing. I mean, the girl is in everything. And then, every now and then, she'll slay a runway. And... Mm -hmm. And then she got a nail shop over there, and I think it's in Harlem. Oh, yeah? So she got a whole lot going on there. Iman, he's, you know, basketball That's and whatnot. And they're both trying to coexist, love each other, be in a marriage, and be parents to Junie with all of this going on. Yeah, I know it's, a, it's, it's a pretty much a challenge. And, we ain't got much going on. It's, and, it's it, it, and it's a challenge to juggle all that stuff. Cause sometimes you can forget. I mean, you can forget about each other. You so you so tied up into mm -hmm. you know working and and doing this and doing that. I mean, we had to pretty much over the last year, so we had to end up cutting out a whole lot of fat out of our life. Yeah. Because it was starting to take over and starting to affect our marriage. I mean, we never talked about it, but you got to know when to when to hold them, and you got to know when to fold. Them. That's it. And so we folded anything that was pretty much hindering us and causing us problems. We folded it. Yeah, and then there was points in the show where you could see Tiana would get mad about stuff, but it wasn't the stuff. It was that they were very frustrated at the lack of time that they have with each other. Mm -hmm. So instead of them communicating and saying, hey, you know, I need your time. You know, get off the phone. This is the only time we have together is in this car right now. Get off yeah. the phone. I'm guilty because Stanley do me the same way all the time. He's yep. like, if you don't get off that goddamn phone. But she'll blow up. And get all mad. And he said, just let me know that you yeah, want me to give you some, some kisses. kisses. That's all y'all doing. Let me know. Just, just, but, just, just let me know. But we never do that, though. I think we should get a jewel man out of just getting pissed off, man. Yeah, because that makeup sex is everything. Yeah. And that's what they do. So that was one of her biggest things. This was like, listen. You you know. I'm sexually frustrated. Now, this is, yeah, this is what I want to talk about. When you know that you are really busy when you got to schedule sex. When you got to do that in your relationship, you're too goddamn busy, man. Yeah. 
And I yeah. think every relationship, if you've been, we've been married 15 years, so mm -hmm. we've been together way longer than that. So if you know anything about couples and when you get together and your routine starts to take over, it will happen. Yep. I met a couple that said they hadn't had sex in a year, and I said, do what? I was what? like, how y'all do that? What? If, what? if we, we make it up on, what, five days, we like, what the hell's going what on? What the hell's going here? on? I'm like, we need to, we need Shut to the windows. We need to communicate. Shut the windows. Put mama out. Let's get it on. <laughs> <laughs> like Tiana say, let's go on the balcony. Let's take a goddamn ride in the truck. In the truck do huh? something. Get on the side of the road. Do whatever you want to do. Look, Tiana and Amon, if y'all ever drop that sex tape, let me know. Because um, I bet you it's exciting. I'm just saying. I guess. I think as crazy as they are and as wild and free as they are, that's that's one I would watch. Okay. Yeah, I'd watch it. Yeah. I watch but, it too, huh? but you know they gotta show me. I ain't, I ain't, <laughs> I ain't stoked yet. God don't. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, I think it's a really, really good show, and I think y'all need to um, yeah, but like you tune say, into you, it. Yeah, it's like you say, you can pick some bits and pieces off of it and apply it to your relationship. Yeah, and just keep see if it works. It's yeah. the first one, and the reason that <clears throat> they said that they decided to put their relationship on Front Street was because. I think they probably are looking through the same lens that people like us look through. Mm -hmm. They look out and there's nobody that's being highlighted unless you're drama, drama filled. Yeah. You got a whole Marriage bunch of mess all going on. Up. You got baby mama drama. Cheating. Yes, you gotta have a whole lot of scandals that, going yeah. on to get highlighted. And they're like We just normal couple. We just normal Normal we, successful couple. Yeah, navigating through this thing called life. Got a baby that we love and enjoy. She says she ain't trying to have no kids no time soon. And that's the reason they just wanted to go ahead and represent black love. So anybody that's got a little caramelization to you. Support them. Support them. So they can so they can continue because what'll end up happening if we don't support them. It's gonna go it's away. It's gonna go away. Yep, at the end of the day, away. this ain't gonna stop their coin, but at the same time, you gotta let these people know that this is what, what you, you want, want to see. see. Yeah. Hello? That I don't wanna, don't wanna see drama, I wanna see positivity. Too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Tiana and Amon, y'all keep doing what y'all doing. Yeah. I and I hope y'all don't, don't change. I hope y'all don't change to get the ratings. Don't, I don't think so. Don't change. Yeah. I, Tiana's kinda like me. It's what you see is what you get. And he's kinda like you. Even kill. Laid don't back. buck with me. Man, he got you the wife that I wanted, though. I yeah. wanted to be a baller, man. I wanted to be a baller so bad, y'all. Your boy had some skills in school, man. That is good at basketball. I had some skills when I... I don't want someone now. I'm, you know, I'm almost five, so I... You know. You are got, like 40. Well, it is kind of... So, you know, God don't... I, you, know, I, you know, I got to brush off a little bit, but... You know what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know. We get ready to go down, down in a rabbit hole. Yeah. And if y'all are new to our channel, you will quickly learn what a rabbit hole is. It's something where we go into these tangents that has nothing to do with the show, but we bring it back and yeah. we wrap it up. So that's what we're going to do straight from the VA. Dirty, dirty south. Two up, two down. Holla. Holla.